Did you know Florida has the largest concentration of natural artesian springs in the world? The average temperature of these Florida springs is 72 degrees Fahrenheit, which is the perfect temperature to keep the manatee warm in the winter months when the temperature in the Gulf can get as low as 50 degrees Fahrenheit. During those colder Gulf temperatures, Many Florida springs become sanctuaries for the manatee population as they seek refuge and try to stay warm. Three Sister Springs, located in Crystal River, Florida, is the only place in Florida where you can swim with the manatee. And while Miss Kayak Seven Seas and I experienced this adventure last year, we thought we would revisit this location with our daughter so she too could enjoy this awesome experience. Join us on today's adventure as we kayak from Kings Bay Park to Three Sister Springs to get a close-up view of Florida's favorite aquatic gentle giant. December 25th, the perfect way to spend a Florida Christmas is kayaking with manatee. We arrived at 10 a.m. The temperature was 66 degrees and we were ready to hit the water. Five minute kayak loading and unloading. Someone needs to tell these two people that's five minutes to have everything out of the car and then I can move it. Now you're gonna have to get in the water already. She's kicked you too far in. <laughs> I, I put the dry uh, towel in a uh, dry bag. Okay. So yeah, butter is covered. Under. Okay. Ready? Yes. All right. Shove off. Breathing. Breathing. Right, breathing. Hello. So we still do not know what this house is to. Uh, there's a lot of birds living on it or recreating on it or just hanging out here. There's a ladder, so maybe someone's doing some work. Front window looks busted. There's a posted no trespassing sign, so we can't go and explore a little bit further. It does have a boat ramp. It has power lines and a street light, but I did not see a meter in the electric panel um, from this distance. So, no idea what this is for. If anybody does know and they're watching this, you could probably comment below and let me know. So, Hunter Springs is to our left. That's where we launched the last time. And we saw a number of manatee as we paddled out towards Three Sisters. This time we launched from Kings Bay, which is not too far away, but it looked like it had better parking for trailers. Parking for $5, $7.50 for parking with a trailer, and there's a $5 per vessel launch. So three vessels is $15, and $7.50 for my truck and trailer. $15 and $7.50, $22.50. Hey, Anna! Yeah. Anna! Shh! You're in a quiet zone.
Huh? It's like they might be building your future house. Yeah. There we go. Just remember, 50 million subscribers, and that house could be mine. <laughs> Can you imagine what it costs to have one of these houses here? I know, I must be. Just because it's on, on the spring water here and a highly populated manatee area. Oh, there's one right there. Oh yeah. <laughs> If you spit in your mask, Ew. No. and then wipe it, wipe it off. Okay. Just kind of with your hand, and then you dunk it. It's real keep it from fogging. I'm just gonna do this. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It'll still fog. And it's not gonna fog with my saliva. Saliva? Why? I don't know. Chemicals. Don't Science. Right. Okay. We're trying to make sure that this is. If you fog, you have to. I'm trying to make sure this is tight enough too. Oh, baby manatee, swimming right by you. Oh, bye, bye, bye. bye. How do we even go there? Yeah, yeah. Camera. <laughs> right here. You get your camera. I'm still trying to yeah, why don't you use your camera? If you listen closely, you can hear the manatee munching on the seagrass. You know, you're used to the water. <laughs> cold to start out with. <laughs> okay, so we only saw one manatee. Um, but one? Well, I only saw one and I followed one. They said they saw two. But still, it was nice because there wasn't very many people in the water. And we pretty much had the manatee to ourselves. And again, they think I'm talking to them when I'm actually talking to you. <laughs> All right. I, I don't like it. Okay. So our plan is let's kayak around a little bit, see how everybody feels. Maybe we'll get back in the water. Maybe <laughs> the water does get it's kind of cold. I mean, I found some warm spots, and that's where the this is where the spring water is coming out of the ground. That's where the fish peed. Uh, okay, or the or fish peed, peed, one or the other. <laughs> so so let's get back in our kayaks and let's kayak around for a little bit. Wind is against us. Hey, get it out! Huh? Right there, on the right. It's about to. Oh, is it that small thing I just saw? Uh huh. It looks tiny. Where was it? Right here. Where is the rock? Oh. It's like a baby gator. Are you finding it? 
I cannot go back up. It's under the uh, roots or something. Well, that answers your questions about gators. Yeah, well, they're here. The smaller ones that are here, right? But if we smaller ones here, small have to become big ones eventually. Yeah, but maybe they move somewhere else for big ones. <laughs> maybe the fish aren't big enough here. But you better think if baby gator is here, that means mama gator is somewhere. Oh. Right in front of y'all. Coming up on. How are y'all doing? Oh, there's one right underneath you, Anna. Wondering why there was no manatee at Three Sisters? Well, because we found them here. Oh, mess of them in the water. Me. All right, we're heading back to the boat launch, and we've got some wind, so it's going to be a little bit of a rough ride getting back, but I'm sure we'll make it. When visiting Crystal River, the best time to see the manatee at Three Sisters Spring is in the fall, winter, and early spring when the weather is colder. Remember, if you choose to swim with the manatee, be sure to give the manatee their space. Please be careful and mindful how your presence affects the manatees. There are several tour companies that offer swim with the manatee tours. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed today's adventure. If so, let us know by clicking that like button. And if you enjoy this type of content, go ahead, hit that subscribe button. Click on that bell icon to turn on notifications so you don't miss out on our next video. We have plenty more kayaking and traveling adventures ahead. Until the next time, I hope to see you out on the water someday.